Hi, and welcome to the Holly C Podcast, a show about expressing your brilliance with ease and flow. I'll show you how to take the woo-woo out of the clouds and apply it to real life for effortless action. This show is for world changers and future world changers. So if you know there's more to life and you're wondering what's next, this is your show. Hi, I'm Holly, your host. I'm a speaker, author, teacher of health, wellness, vitality, and spirituality, and also a dragon spirit guide. Today's episode is actually a recording that I made for a live presentation about two years ago, but dragon spirit, the universe, gave me a little nudge and said, Holly, you need to share this with people on your podcast. So I took a listen to it and I was like, oh my gosh, that message is so spot on. This is a message that I need to share with you. And it's also a good reminder for myself. So I'm going to play this very uplifting dragon spirit meditation for you right now. Let's just get into the dragon spirit space right now. So what I'm going to ask you to do is to place your hand on your heart and bring your awareness there. You might want to close your eyes. Just take a deep breath. Ah, Just kind of shake out your body. And I'm going to ask you to enter the dragon spirit space. You're going to take three breaths. So you're going to breathe in through your nose and you're going to breathe out through your mouth. And I'll just walk you through that right now. And one more thing too, as you breathe out through your mouth, if you feel like letting out like a sigh, kind of just all that stuff inside, like a ha. Ah, or a ha, feel free to do so. Because if you're at home watching, then nobody's going to notice. And if you're at work, at least just mentally, energetically, imagine yourself doing that, okay? So breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Ha, relaxing your jaw as you breathe out. And again, in through your nose, filling your chest with light energy and breathing out. Ah. On the third time, imagine breathing deep into your belly, breathing in, feeling that energy going down to your belly and breathing out, energy coming out from your belly. Ah. Now with the dragon spirit sessions, hmm, I tune in to all of your energy, everybody listening, even the recording. And I hear from the universe, from your soul, yeah, your soul, (laughs) different images, different words, messages, and I share them with you because hmm, as we go through this journey, it may seem unusual, but it is exactly what you need right now. Breathe in through your nose and just breathe out normally. And the image I'm seeing, it keeps, I keep looking at it going, is this the one? And it is, it's a xylophone, okay? It's not a plastic one. It is a wooden one. Hmm. Now I do see some colors on it. So I want you to imagine this as I describe it to you. There's like a a purple wooden slat. There's a green one. Uh, There's an orange one. What's interesting is the colors are on one side. And as the little wooden uh, pieces get smaller, the ones that you strike on, Uh, They just kind of go to like a plain wood color. So the colorful ones are on the bigger uh, pieces of wood on the left side. And the other ones are on the right side, kind of going smaller and smaller and smaller. Breathe in through your nose. And just breathe out regularly again. Ah, So unless I ask you to let out a big sigh, uh, just breathe out normally. Now, I want you to imagine, oh, this is interesting. Uh, you're going to imagine picking up a stick for playing the xylophone. And you actually have two sticks. So one in each hand, the left hand and the right hand. And you're holding them. And again, breathe in through your nose and breathe out. Hmm. Now, as an adult, you're looking at the xylophone and it actually looks kind of tiny. So you're going to imagine, because when you're in the dragon spirit space, it's all about tuning in to energy and there's no limits to energy or no limits or bounds to your imagination. You're going to imagine yourself as a child holding that same xylophone, those same two sticks, breathing in 
and breathing out. So maybe suddenly the xylophone became bigger or suddenly you became smaller and now these sticks are heavier and weightier. The xylophone is almost like, looks like half your size now, as opposed to as an adult, it was like this teeny little thing. Now it's like half your body size. And you're looking at it. And you're looking up closely at these colorful slats and you decide to strike a note. Which one do you strike? Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out. There's no right or wrong answer here. If you're wondering about which is right, that's your mind. That's your mind stepping up and mm, trying to figure things out. So we're going to give the mind a task. The mind is going to uh, be like a fly on the wall, just observing and recording so that you remember what you're experiencing right now. Pay attention to your breathing. Pay attention to your posture. Pay attention to the thoughts going through your mind. Breathe in through your nose. Pay attention to your breathing and breathe out. Ah. And again, as a child, you're going to just kind of go into your easy rhythm where you, when you breathe in, you lift up that little xylophone stick, you breathe out, and you strike a note. And go ahead, imagine yourself playing the xylophone however you want. Now, hmm, the insight that you are to pay attention to, that your mind is to pay attention to, is that as a child, how much spontaneity is there in wanting to play these notes? And how much is there, hmm, like the mind being the adult, insisting on the right way, the wrong way, the this must do it this way, oh, what are these colors for? Why are these ones different? Breathe in through your nose, breathe out. Remind your mind it's supposed to be a fly on the wall. So it's gonna just observe. So let the child play. And again, imagine yourself playing. You feel the freedom you feel the excitement. You feel the sense of adventure, not knowing what sound is going to come out, not needing to know what sound is going to come out. Breathe in through your nose and breathe out. Now I want you to gradually allow yourself to go back into your body as an adult. As you breathe gently, maybe the xylophone's shrinking again. Do you feel a sense of loss? Or do you feel a sense of excitement? Perhaps you feel a sense of loss because, oh, that exuberance is, you know, faded away with that energy of the child. Or maybe you feel a sense of excitement because that energy, that exuberance of the child has come forth with you. Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out. If you feel like it slipped away, go back to being a child for a moment. The child where the mind is just a fly on the wall watching, not the one directing the play. And again, feel the joy and the excitement. And bring that energy forth. And whenever you need to tune back into that energy, just imagine yourself playing the xylophone. Okay. That's what, hmm, well, one more message for you. Oh, let's just play. <laughs> That's the message, P-L-A-Y. Because mm, too much seriousness, just remember the xylophone, that exuberance, that energy of play. And on that note, <laughs> get the pun, note, <laughs> time to play, right? We are going to exit the Dragon Spirit space for now. But this space is always there for you. You just need to tune in to your heart and your spirit and feel into the energy of your soul. So we'll exit with three Dragon Spirit breaths. So breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth, hand on the heart, and I'll walk you through it. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Ah, In through your nose. Out through your mouth. Ah. And once more, in through your nose. And out through your mouth. Ah. And we're back in our podcast now. Thank you for joining in. It was a short meditation, but I hope you will take it to heart and you will play with it. So I'm looking forward to when we reconnect again. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.